once said transdimensional travel was too dangerous. <laughs> of course, everything's solid here. What a strange dimension. <gasps> dinosaurs! This dimension still has dinosaurs! I'll infuse them with intelligence and make them my soldiers. When the Quadranian High Council sees these monsters at my command, they cannot ignore me. First, let's expand those minuscule brains of yours. Now, I'll imbue you with eons of knowledge in a microsecond. Oh, yes. These will do nicely. Whoa! How'd you do that? Check it out! A talking dinosaur! Hey, I'm talking too! Our primitive craniums have obviously been modified to comprehend highly complex intellectual constructs. You didn't do this just because you like us. Oh, but I do! You're big and strong and terrifying! Just what I need to make the Quadranians fear and obey me! Not a chance! Out of the question! Forget it! But you must obey me! You're my creations! Wanna try and make us? I think you're right! Next batch, more viciousness, less independent thinking. So aggressive and evil. They're perfect. Hey, scope out the rafters. Looks like he's at it again. Raptors and brains. Dangerous combination. Lieutenant, you know transdimensional travel is strictly forbidden. But we'll lose Argor, Captain Bodzak. How can we call ourselves law officers when we ignore the laws ourselves? Well done. Oh, very well done. You do this. Mm -hmm. I'm Argor Zardok, your new master. My man. So, what's the agenda? A thousand more like you and Quadrania will be groveling at my feet. No, oh, it's a Quadranian security cruiser. Let us have him. We'll chew him up and eat him for lunch. You're nasty, rotten, and cruel. You make me proud. Bad rap, this is a plasma detonation launcher. The most powerful weapon Quadranian technology ever created. It, my design, actually. Hax, these hollow blades are for you. And you, Spitter, the chemicals in these tanks can melt the hardest steel in a chromosecond. Go on, try them out. Like this. That's a violation of Code 602, Paragraph B. Yes, that's why we call him a criminal. Oh, this is precisely why it's against the law to leave our dimension. It's so solid here. Who do you think they are? Well, Argor shot him down. It can't be all bad. Hey! You okay? Everyone uh, all right? Hey, you need some help. Halt! Oversized wild beasts are not permitted to eat Quadranian security forces. Now, now that you mention it, I did miss lunch. I... I don't know which law it is, but I'm sure it's in here somewhere. Eat you? Yuck! <laughs> Give me a nice toss, swamp reed salad mm, any day. With some spicy algae on the side. Scrumptious. Wait, you're talking dinosaurs. Yeah, and you're a talking whatever you are. I'm T-Bone. This is Steggs, Spike, and Bullseye. Stay back. We're apprehending a dangerous criminal, Argar Zardok. It looks like it could use some help. We're ready to rumble any time, any place. No, you mustn't interfere. Code 502, Section P. This Argor guy's creating an army of raptors. You're gonna need our help. Impossible. Code 911, Section C states that all combat activities must be performed by authorized personnel. <laughs> that authorized enough for you? Those raptors will turn you into snack food. We'll see about that. Lieutenant, get this cruiser moving! Well, stay loose, guys. She's gonna be needing us sooner than she knows. Excellent! 
More raptors for more mayhem. That security cruise is trying to take off again. Well, go down and stop them. Yes, master. Dimension. Who knows what it'll do here? <laughs> Let's find out. It's dissolving the Earth's outer crust! Can it be stopped? I don't think so. No, my disruptor must be too powerful for this dimension. At least I got my raptors. I can't save bad rap. Oh well. Uh, bye, fellas! This is exactly why transdimensional travel is forbidden! Argor's destroyed the place! Evacuate now! What about you, Captain? Code 3389, Section B. A Quadranian officer's primary duty is to protect civilians. Those dinosaurs? Yes, now go! Quadranians are leaving! Great! Trash the place, and thing! Inside! Hurry! We don't have much time! These deep freeze chambers should keep us safe until a rescue party arrives. Rescue party? Code 55 paragraph 9 states... We'll take your word for it. Let's hope we have a long shelf life. This belongs in Detroit, circa 1957. Huh, you'd think these guys would find something better to do with a foundation grant. <laughs> Frozen dinosaurs! Wonderful, Beckman, really. <laughs> and I'll bet this is the tip. To I'd almost buy it if you hadn't used Dino. Amazing. A hairless <gasps> mammal. <laughs> and it talks. I had the strangest dream. We were fighting raptors and... No dream, bird brain. Thanks for your interest, Dr. Benning. We'll handle it from here. What's going on? This is too big a find to be handled by civilians. There, that didn't hurt, did it? <laughs> Talking dinosaurs. Oh, an evil 
evolved dinosaurs with brains bigger than walnuts. This is an astonishing find. It's coming too. Are you sure about those restraints? Rescue us from cataclysmic disaster, but it was her people who caused it. Guys, come on. If this 562 code says let her go, let's give the lady a break. Yes! I salute your respect for Quadranian law. Great. More sleeping gas. Come on, guys. Let's Jurassicate this place! Bullseye! The window! Get out of here! Ah! long enough to get us out of here. Let's blow this place to sea! After them! Where are all the dinosaurs? We gotta find them. Uh, guys, I, I uploaded their database to catch up on the time we missed. It's been 65 million years. So, if those fur-faced mammals could have lost so much, but think what dinosaurs must be like now. T-Bone, the dinosaurs are gone. <gasps> you mean they went somewhere else? She means gone, defunct, vanished, extinct. We don't belong here. We've got company. Four vehicles gaining speed. I'll try to lose them. Special. Living near Roswell, I've seen it all. In fact, some other dinosaurs on the tube right now. See for yourselves. It's time we take back control of this planet from the hairless mammals. Join me, brethren. The world shall be ours again. We gotta stop him. If Bad Rap uses his weapon, he could destroy the world all over again. Ah, they already ruined the cable access station. I'll help you. If you promise to get him off the air. Now, when you go into battle, you gotta be mobile. 
we can use some stuff from here and uh, some stuff from your ship, too. <laughs> Fix your right up. Well, nice work, guys. Ready to thrash some rafters? Guys, hold on! According to Code 508, Section D... Uh, Chedra, that code book of yours is 65 million years out of date. Let's move it! Wait, guys! Wait for me! You need some help in there? We're getting calls from all kinds of weirdos who don't believe we're for real, and others who want to send us money. We are for real! For just $15.95, we will prove we are real! Raptors! At last! They've come to join us! Wrong, Bad Rap. You're gonna join them. Extinction is imminent. <laughs> We're 65 million years out of time. Yes, but so are the raptors. They're an extreme threat. Someone's got to be here to keep them in line. Someone equally extreme. Yeah, that's us. The extreme dinosaurs. So, what do you think? Sounds good. Actually, it sounds real good. T-Bone? Come in, T-Bone. Where are you guys? According to Code 7, Right here, Chedra. In case you want to know, the extreme dinosaurs are headed for the nearest hot springs for a little R&R. &R. Join us, right? Wait, so who 